All right, hello everybody. So, 3 a.m., no heat. I didn't think to record this and share my experience until now, but uh, better late than never. So, what sounded like water in the pump, um, for lack of a better term, or for lack of knowing the correct term, the air handler, First time running the propane heat since um, it started to get colder and the heat pump could not um, satisfy the heat requirements. So first time the, the furnace was switching over to the propane backup. It ran for a little bit and then stopped. So just doing a little bit of Googling, um, I will preface by saying that the status lights were blinking in a fashion where it was the this area right in here where the condenser condenser line was blocked or some sort of a blocked inlet or exhaust vent. So As you can see, it is up and running fine now, but the root cause was water over the summertime or condensation collecting in this fan housing right here. So all I did was turn the unit off, disconnected the power and unscrewed all four of the bolts. First I disconnected the power line to it and then disconnected the clamp that went up to this housing, this tubing up there. And I was able to pull the housing out and dump it into a nearby bucket and the result was a cup's worth, cup and a half of water stuck in that fan housing that prevented airflow and just shut the unit down. So the learning here is if you, if it sounds like there's water while the fan is trying to run and it sounds like it's sloshing around, that could very well be your issue. So hope this helps. Next time I'll be a little bit proactive with recording my play-by-play -play. however I'm just thrilled that I don't have to call to get emergency service at 3 in the morning and I didn't break anything so you know it looks like a complete win so hope this helps